Let's get the latest from AccuWeather and meteorologist Cecily Tynan. And Jim, we have some much needed rain on the way. It's not arriving tonight though. Storm Tracker 6 live double scan showing that here we are dry tonight. There's a warm front though that's lifting closer to the Poconos. That could bring a touch of freezing rain early in the morning in the Poconos. Today though, we were just dealing with increasing clouds through the day. And I got this great photo posted on my Facebook page from Lori. She posted this from Paoli. My daughter actually asked me about the clouds. She just took a picture too. What are these clouds? These are alto stratus clouds and these are mid level clouds made of ice and water droplets and they were kind of fighting dry air. So we did have some breaks in the clouds. You can see a little bit of blue. These are the clouds we see in front of a storm system and there is a system on the way. It's going to take its time getting here though. But what a difference a week makes and we actually took an informal poll on our Twitter page. What do you like better a week ago a record warmth of 86 degrees or today's weather 10 degrees below normal that fall chill 53 so far warmth is winning 55% to 45% having our own kind of election here you can still vote on at 6 ABC weather and let us know which you prefer right now. It's on the cool side, not as chilly as last night. Philadelphia 48, Allentown 44, Cape May 48, Reading 45. The Poconos, the cool spot, dropping down to 34 degrees. And Satellite 6, along with Action Radar, showing some of this light precipitation. It's not reaching the ground, but there is a possibility the Poconos could get brushed with a little bit of light rain tonight. Could freeze on surfaces. We really have to wait for the cold front to arrive late in the day and tomorrow night, and that's what will bring us the rain. But that freezing rain advisor has been posted from 2 o'clock in the morning until 11 o'clock in the Poconos. The higher elevations could get a light coating of freezing rain. So if you're traveling there tomorrow morning, you really want to take it easy here at home. Just mainly a lot of clouds, perhaps a few showers in the Lehigh Valley in the morning. Then as we head towards noontime again, the showers well north. The showers arriving here around 5 o'clock and actually intensifying through Thursday evening with some gusty winds, maybe even a rumble of thunder and behind that system on Friday. We get that wind tunnel effect with high pressure building in winds out of the northwest 30 to 35 miles per hour and the high only 57. So the exclusive AccuWeather 7 day forecast, it's breezy, cloudy. The showers arriving in the afternoon and evening 58 degrees. It's dry but breezy on Friday 57 Saturday. Warm 72 degrees, still pretty mild on Sunday 67 for Halloween. We get a sunny treat. No tricks from the weather department. 60 degrees and dry. Bump it up to 66 on Tuesday and Wednesday. Mostly sunny with a high of 68 degrees. And of course, David Murphy will be tracking the possibility of freezing rain in the Poconos tomorrow morning on Action News beginning at 430. So if those Alto Stratus clouds sort of drift and go away to the east, but then come back, Aren't they retrograde? They're retrograde. Alto stress. Yeah, cut? that's very rare that that would actually happen. I but would imagine. You would call it that. <laughs> Thank you, <laughs> You're Cecily. You're welcome.